me, Lucy. Last week, we learned about friendship and how Jonathan helped his best friend, David. Today, our Bible story will tell us how David showed kindness to his friend, Jonathan, even after he had died. Kindness is our topic today. Have you ever let a friend go first to play with a new game or toy? Hooray for you! Did you know that when you show kindness, it not only makes others happy, it makes God happy too. Proverbs 3.3 3 says, Don't ever stop being kind and truthful. Let kindness and truth show in all you do. When Tommy's mom first told him they were going to help Mrs. Cobb, an elderly lady from their church, he thought it would be boring. But he was wrong. Mrs. Cobb tells wonderful stories and makes yummy pies. Tommy looks forward to spending time with her. He shows kindness by being polite and helping her by doing things like holding the car door open. Being kind is a good way to show God's love. Let's read our story together and see how David showed kindness to his friend. Be kind. Long ago, David's best friend Jonathan died. After David became king, he wanted to show kindness to Jonathan by helping anyone who was alive in Saul's family. David learned that Jonathan's son, Mephibosheth, was crippled in both feet and living in Lodabar. David was very kind to Mephibosheth. He treated Jonathan's son as if he were one of his own sons and always let him eat at his table. He also made sure that all of Jonathan's property was returned to Mephibosheth and that the land was farmed so Mephibosheth would always have food to eat. Mephibosheth lived in Jerusalem and David took care of him his whole life. David was kind. If you were Mephibosheth, how would David's kindness make you feel? Are your manners as nice as David's? Here's a fun quiz on kindness. Answer true or false. If someone does something nice for you, you should say nothing. False. When you are finished with dinner, it is kind to help with the dishes. True. When you receive a gift, you should say thank you. True. When you see a line of kids waiting for their turn on a ride, it is kind to push them out of the way and jump in the ride first. False. How did you do? Let's work hard to be extra kind this week. And next week we will talk about one of the ways we can be kind. Sharing. See you then. Bye, friends. Delor, I want to be a kind child and think of others first. Please help me use good manners. Amen.